Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another Sunday Live activation. How is everybody doing here? Who is here live and those watching the replay later? How's it going? We've got Zach, Victor, Claire, Lakeside, Laura. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the party. <laughs> so today we're going to be talking about the financial system. I've received some messages about the financial system recently and um, last night, actually. And we're also going to do, after we talk about that for a little bit, um, and talk about the money wound that we need to heal as a collective uh, because we've been programmed um, to basically live in like a, a, a slave-like system. And these money wounds carry through generations. We'll get into that in a second. <laughs> and uh, well, then we'll be doing a channeled activation to help clear any of those blockages help reprogram that with the crystal alchemy singing bowl, help cut any cords and help you to shift into an abundance mindset. So this is going to be about the financial system, but also the activation will also be about just opening up to receive blessings and abundance. It doesn't have to necessarily be money. It can be abundance in other ways. So yeah, I've got my abundance moonstone to help with abundance. Awesome. Hi, Katie. <laughs> You're all warmed up. Let's go, Steve. Yeah, so this is a really important topic right now. So I'll go ahead and dive right into uh, some of the messages that I've been receiving. So last night, uh, I think it was last night or the night before, I woke up in the middle of the night and I saw that the economy is going is about to go way, 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 way up. Um, and if you remember in my messages from the future video, uh, that I did in the beginning of 2023, it was about 2023 and beyond. The ETs told me that around Christmas time, which is now, uh, there was going to be something that happens that increases abundance on the planet and decreases poverty, like greatly. So, you know, Christmas has come and gone. And I was wondering about that. And about a month ago, they showed me uh, a financial collapse. And I got a little bit of more information on it. And what they're telling me right now is that this is actually happening right now. Like the shift is happening right now. So the old systems are collapsing, but we're not really seeing it. We're seeing it a little bit, but not much. And the new systems are being put in place right now behind the scenes. Uh, gold keeps coming up. I believe uh, the financial system will be gold backed. Because now we just have like the paper, you know, dollar and that doesn't really even mean anything. <laughs> um, but I feel like it may take a little bit of time for us to see like this abundance like coming in and for the economy to go up. And specifically, I saw Donald Trump and I believe uh, whenever either he's back in office or during the next uh, presidential election, once that happens, then we're going to see the economy going way up is the messages that I got. Slaves no more. I like it. So yeah, basically the new money systems are being put in place right now. We're just not, it's, we're not seeing it uh, from our perspective yet, but I believe it'll be coming in some point this year or after the presidential election, which is pretty exciting. And who knows what, uh, you know, what, maybe they're going to send us all fat checks for scamming us, the government, for so many years. That would be pretty cool. <laughs> uh, like I said, it'll be gold-backed. And I wanted to also share a tip. So Star Family, a little while ago, they were guiding me to get some crypto. So that may be a good idea to invest in if you can. I think crypto is going to really blow up. So if you have like five, 10 extra dollars, put it in crypto. Specifically, they told me to put it into XRP. I've put a little bit into some other things too, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. And of course, crypto can be a little bit of a gamble. So, you know, go with your intuition, research that more if you'd like, but that's, that's what I'm doing. So I wanted to share that with you guys. Um, you know, people who invested in Bitcoin in the beginning, 
I mean, who knows how many millionaires and even billionaires Bitcoin made? <laughs> the people who invested in the very beginning. So I feel like we're going to have a situation similar to that. I don't know if it'll be on that scale. Um, but yeah, that's pretty exciting. So if you just put like 20 bucks in or, you know, whatever here and there, that could be a good idea. <laughs> Work it out universe. Yeah. And they may actually erase all of our debts. That's what I'm really hoping for. <laughs> Cause I mean, it's a scam. It's a scam. So hopefully there will be some, you know, debt forgiveness. Maybe the whole thing will just reset. And uh, we'll kind of like start from scratch with these new systems where there will be abundance for everybody. So that's how we're supposed to be. We're supposed to be, we're supposed to live in abundance. There are more than enough resources to go around on the entire planet. There's no reason for so many people to be without water or, you know, not be able to afford food. It's insane. Thank you, Paz. I appreciate that. Um, I have heard of Archangel Azrael. I don't know if I've worked with him personally. So let me uh, take a second and check the chat. I'm feeling crazy downloads for the last few days as well. Didn't come to this planet again to lose. We're living in a very exciting, crazy time. This year is going to be insane. Honestly, like we already started off with a bang. You've got the Epstein list coming out. You've got uh, the Miami Mall incident, which I did a remote viewing session on that, a psychic session on that. And that was way more detailed and in-depth than I thought. Um, so you can check out that video if you'd like. But yeah, this is just the beginning. The Yes, the crypto backed by metals. Wrote down XRP in my notes. Yeah. And with the XRP, I don't know when that's going to go way up. So it may be with the uh, the the crypto people call it diamond hands where you put it in there and then you just hold it and you leave it for a while. Like you leave it. So you might not make your money back, you know, immediately, but just holding it in there, kind of forget about it is what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing personally. So we've got some other crypto people in here, XRP, XLM. Uh, I did put some in XLM as well. Casino coin. I haven't heard of that. Definitely fat checks coming. Uh, do you have a reference on where to start to do this with XRP? So I personally got the app Exodus. If you're talking about like, how do you do it? I got the app Exodus and you have to set up your whole thing. It's kind of annoying, but you have to set up an account and all of that. And, um, and then you can buy it through the Exodus app. But if anybody else has any recommendations for crypto, because I don't know that that much about it. I had a good friend of mine help me set all of that up who knows a lot about it, um, feel free to drop in the comments or in the chat if you have any recommendations. Uh, Hopewell Farms accept crypto, XRP, and Bitcoin for payment on our website. That's awesome. Yeah. Thank you, BB. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. That helps the channel a lot. Bye, Andromeda. I had medical debt literally erased. I thought it was a joke. I got a notice that said some hospital bill bills had been taken care of. What? I wish somebody would, I wish that would happen to me. That seizure that I had after the, um, I don't I mean, I, it, if you don't have insurance, it's just, it's insane too. It's all a scam. I tried making a doctor's appointment the other day and they said, um, you know, we're not accepting patients without insurance and to get insurance. I don't know how much that is. It's literally a joke, but that's amazing. Leah. Yeah. The medical bills, um, all that. So yeah, I'm checking up on the chat real quick. Will new energy help with finding a better job? Yeah, I think so. Definitely. So the energy going on right now, while I'm feeling a lot of like massive upgrades, a lot of deep remembrance, there's a lot going on behind the scenes, uh, spiritually in the astral realms. And right now we're losing, letting go of what no longer serves us to make room for what does. So in a second, I'll also be talking about kind of like money mindset, abundance mindset. So there's a lot of beliefs, scarcity beliefs, fear-based beliefs that we have to let go of in order to open up to receive what is for us. But Jason, you can set the intention and just ask the universe, you know, can you please uh, please, please bring me a job 
that I will enjoy and that will take care of me and that is in alignment with me. Ask the universe. That's your number one thing that you do. You got to ask first and then be open to receive it. And the universe will start giving you signs. And if you're not finding something right now, then the then something is being woven behind the scenes for you. So it may take a little bit of time. Uh, yeah, what else did I want to talk about? So there's a very, very, um, very toxic mindset a lot of people have with money. And I, you know, I kind of used to have it too. Thank you, Phil, so much. I really appreciate that. And it's that money is bad and that money's evil. So there's, there's actually um, a book that I read that really helped me with this. So I started out um, doing nutrition and health content before this under a whole different account. And I wanted to start my own business doing that, helping people. And I had a really, really difficult time. My content was doing great. I was helping. I've literally helped thousands, maybe even a million people lose weight and get healthier. And I was working so, so hard, but I could not bring myself to like, it just, it wasn't working, starting a business and making money off of it. Um, and one of the things, aspects of that is like not believing that you're deserving of having abundance, not believing that you're worth it and that you can you know, be successful. That's another big wound that a lot of us have. And if there are any people in here who want to be an entrepreneur and start your own spiritual business, that's something to keep in mind. And we'll work through that a bit during the activation. But that was a big problem that I was having. I was filling up everybody else's cup and I wasn't filling up my own. So I actually read a book called, what is it called? It's Not Your Money. And this really, really helped with uh, abundance mindset and kind of changing your perspective on what money is. So there's a lot of people, they, <laughs> they also, they, they just hate money. They think it's evil. And if you hate it and you think it's evil, like it's not going to come to you. <laughs> You're not really like opening up to receive it. And unfortunately right now we, we live in a system where, you know, we have to survive with money. That's the system that we have right now. Of course, as we ascend, we'll drop that system and we won't need that anymore, but we got to play by what we have right now and help create new systems. So it's really important to shift your mindset on money. And the book is called, uh, It's Not Your Money. It's a very spiritual book. And it explains how money is just an exchange of energy. So don't think about it. It's not your money. It's just an exchange of money, exchange of energy. It is essentially source, an exchange of energy. So if you shift your mindset like that, that is very, very helpful. Um, in getting rid of the lack mindset. A lot of us have been really deeply programmed with a lack mindset. That there's not enough for us, uh, that we don't deserve this. We don't deserve to live a nice, you know, lifestyle or, or, or be comfortable. We have to struggle. That's been deeply ingrained in us for generations. And we, we're going to clear up some of that during the activation, uh, as well. So we should be living an abundant lifestyle. And we also need wealthy spiritual people. All of the people who have money right now, not all of them, but most of them are terrible people. <laughs> that's why the world is in shambles. That's the way, that's why the world is the way it is. All big pharma, uh, the food corporations, uh, the, the, you know, the toxic medical, uh, health field, all of these things, very, very toxic. These people that have money, like the Rockefellers, the Rothschilds, BlackRock, all these companies that control everything. They're terrible people. And they do that because they have a ton of money. So we need to start allowing abundance in as spiritual awakened people so that we can begin rising and taking their place. They're going to fall. We're going to rise. They're going to fall. We need, we need uh, spiritual millionaires to set up, to create all of these wonderful services for people um, to help make changes. Like you need money to do that right now. 
So we need wealthy spiritual people. So there's some people, um, I'll bring this up right now too, since we're talking about finances. Um, I haven't had too many, but I've had some comments and emails uh, kind of mad about me charging for my workshops. And I would like to uh, say that first off, I do free live activations every Sunday. <laughs> and I probably have, I have almost 200 videos, content sharing, doing free, you know, energy work, um, teaching things that Star Family has taught me that I literally spent two years learning, training, in-depth training. I was unemployed for a full year. I was living off of credit cards. Those credit cards maxed out. I couldn't pay them. They closed. By the end of it, I literally had like no money. I couldn't even go to the gas station. And, you know, I, I still had faith, but it, it was really hard. I was like, I was drowning, but I had faith. So I spent a lot of energy training to get to where I'm at and to be able to help as many people as possible. So I do a lot of free content on here, but then, you know, I do some workshops and other things that are, you know, paid things. So you don't have to get my workshop to connect with your star family. You can do that right here. And right now you can do that on your own, but, uh, but I also need, you know, to pay the bills. I have to pay rent too. <laughs> so I just wanted to say that, you know, you don't have to get my workshops in order to do these things. Um, I have tons of other free videos or you can go somewhere else. Uh, so yeah, I just wanted to mention that. So we really need to get rid of the kind of like the, the, the lack mindset and the hatred of money. And that really is a projection of your own insecurities and your own trauma, really deep trauma and deep programming. So yeah. Okay, I'm going to stop talking for a second. Check the chat. And YouTube doesn't pay much. That's like a couple hundred bucks a month. Yeah. Yep, There's. it's just a big control method, but we have to play with what we have right now in order to, uh, to rise up and change these systems. But like I said, and what the Starvings have been telling me, there's literally new financial systems being put in place right now. So it's going to be fantastic. Electricity. Yeah, the power is power is a scam. We, sh we should have, there's free energy all around us. And that has been suppressed. We need to make money to fight these guys. Exactly. Just like with Elon Musk, um, even if you don't like him, uh, he it, he's very wealthy. And so he has the power to stand up and say, I'm not going to bend down to you, to the advertisers. They can't control him because he has... They can't control him with money or blackmail him with money because he has all the money <laughs> and he can create a, you know, a, a censorship free, the only censorship, censorship free platform out there right now, whenever YouTube and all these other platforms are really buckling down on censorship and it's, it's literally crazy. So we need wealthy, uh, spiritual and awakened people. I think I'm a little behind. Thanks, Craig. I just purchased some workshops. I considered it an exchange of energy. I appreciate that. And like I said, I also have tons of free activations and tools on my channel. And they demonetize people. YouTube does. Yeah, they just demonetized uh, Journey to Truth podcast. They've been taking down a bunch of their stuff. It's crazy. Thank you, Joan. Nice. Info prism. I lost everything, both my business and the pan pandemic. I have nothing now. Yet I know when time is right, I will be blessed. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. But um, yeah, there's a grander divine plan happening. So you like I had to lose everything. I lost my job. I lost my car. I lost uh, a partner. I lost uh, everything all at the same time. And then I went into really deep spiritual training and I had to lose everything in order to, you know, activate these, these new gifts and really find myself and remember who I am. And then when the time was right, things just started to line up perfectly. So that's amazing. Things will start lining up. Whatever is right for you will show up in divine timing. Thank you guys. Checking the email, or not the emails. I 
thank you, Amy. <laughs> you don't need to explain yourself. Ask those people if they go to work for free. <laughs> yeah, I know most of you guys understand that, but I just wanted to say it because I have uh, received, I think, two emails recently of a healthy spiritual person. She's an Arcturian starseed. Yeah, I've heard of uh, I've heard of her. We would love to give CBD plant medicine away too, but we got to make a living too. Exactly. One on our list is health, wellness, two, making a living. Hi, Lenny. Thank you. Weekly free meditations help so many. With 200 videos, where do we start? That's a good, uh, good question. So for my live activations, you can, if you want to do like these, and if you don't want to, you know, stick to the, the first part where I'm explaining things, I also share messages, updates, things like that, or teach you how to do something or, or share messages from the ETs. You can skip ahead, of course, to the part where I pick up the bowl. But uh, I would just go to my lives tab and scroll through that. That's where all of those are. And just pick what stands out to you. The chakra series is good. I have a playlist on that. If you... Um, really I have a star origins playlist too, where we have sessions with the Arcturians, the Pleiadians. So if you know what type of star seed you are and you want to work more closely with your star family, go to videos like that. If you don't know who your star family is, just follow your intuition, start skimming through those and literally pick your intuition will guide you. Ask the universe, okay, what should I start with? And then start scrolling through and then pick whatever stands out and just trust that you'll find. Um, I also have a, a playlist that teaches you three ways e ETs are communicating with you and you may not realize it. That's really great for helping you to communicate with them, um, affirmations, other messages, and, and things like that. So hopefully that's helpful. Yeah, so this is very exciting. I got XRP and XLM and holding them with diamond, diamond hands. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Nancy. Your DNA activations are priceless. Yeah. How's everybody feeling, by the way? And then we'll get started on the activation in just a second. Thanks, Tony. I appreciate that. I'm personally so thankful for these lives every week. I always say how you're one of the very few that, that do this for free. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know if anybody else is doing this. <laughs> and if you guys are here right now, please hit the like button. And... Some people aren't seeing my videos pop up, so you can also hit the bell icon and turn the notifications on. So after this, I'm actually going to be taking two weeks off from the live activations because I just, I need to, I have to do some very intense training. I may be posting other small, like shorter videos, like messages and updates, because I'm getting a lot of downloads and messages from Star Family right now, similar to the Miami Mall incident, you know, things that are going on, news, um, so turn on the notification bell so that you can see those. And um, and I would also challenge you during the next two weeks, since I won't be here on Sunday, go through and pick one of the other live activations to do. Or you can do, uh, you know, another meditation from somebody else. The heart activations, that's a really good point. That's a great place to start, starting with the heart. We really need to open our heart. That's the number one focus. That's the key, as Star Family says. Love the short videos. Me too. I haven't had time to make them lately. Um, so yeah, I really like, I really want to do kind of like a revamp on my whole channel and I want to do more short videos, but still that short video, that 12 minute video took me two to three hours, three hours to make. <laughs> so it took a lot of time and energy to edit. You know, I'm a one person band here. Um, but yeah. Okay. So let's just kind of look through. Um, the root chakra, I'd also like to mention the root chakra is where a lot of lack and programming gets stuck. That's the root chakra is, you know, the bottom chakra near the base of your spine, the red one. That is your sense of safety, security, and it has a lot to do with finances too. So if you feel like you have like a money block or an abundance block, focusing on your root chakra is going to be very, very powerful, helping to clear that. And whenever we start the channeled activation, I'll channel that also. But you may want to focus on that some more. Uh, so, yeah, the root chakra is really responsible for finances. Also having faith, trusting, ask spirit. Your heart is another really important part of it. 
So in the beginning, I was trying to communicate, starting to communicate with my guides and all of that, and I wasn't really hearing them. Um, this is also at the time where I, uh, you know, didn't have any money. Uh, things were just crazy. And I went to go see a psychic, and she said, they're trying to help you, but you have to open your heart to let them in. And I was like, wow, that's crazy. <laughs> Sounds very simple, but I never thought of that. And it was so profound. So what I did after that, I did a short heart opening meditation, which I do have one of those, a short recorded one uh, in one of my playlists, in my meditations playlist. It's 13 minutes long. And I focused on starting to open my heart to allow blessings in, to allow assistance from star family, from source, from the angels to also allow communication so I could hear the universe more, you know, better. And that was incredibly profound. So opening your heart to allow this stuff in is also very important. Being heart-centered. And I think that might be it. Um, cutting cords in the ancestral trauma. So a lot of us, this has been a reoccurring, repeating theme, just living in poverty, in scarcity, uh, and with a lack mindset for generations. And that gets ingrained into you. Um, so we'll go through and help clear that during the activation. Help clear and eliminate that programming. Shifting into an abundance mindset and energy. So we attract the energy that we're putting out. So if you're putting out, like I said, you know, I hate money or I don't have money or I don't, you know, this never happens to me. I can never hear my star family. Uh, you know, I can't talk to the universe. I'm not psychic. I'm not good enough. Like that's what you're going to receive. So you really have to shift your energy, shift your frequency to allow all of that stuff in and you will be amazed. And also know that you're worth it. If you want to start your own business, like you're worth it. You're worth success. You can help people. So affirmations will help with that and then open to receive. And then, of course, having faith and trust in the process and always ask, ask the universe, ask source. So re to recap the financial shift real quick. So there's a financial collapse happening right now. The old and the new systems are being put in place right now that are going to benefit us. It's happening in the background. And uh like I said the other night, I saw the I received a, a vision of the economy just skyrocketing. And I believe it did have to do with Trump whenever he's uh comes back or whatever he's gonna do uh in the next year. Uh gold backed, it will be gold backed, and then also a rise in crypto and digital currency. So, like I said, if you can invest in that, I would and then hold it. And then that's about it. Does anybody have any questions? And then we'll get started in the activation. So sit up with your spine straight or you can lie down either way. And then we'll get started because I've been talking for a long time. <laughs> so you don't have to be an avid meditator to get anything out of this. Um, all you have to do is relax. You can either sit up straight because we'll be working uh, with your energy, with the star being, star family, with source, with the angels, archangels. So either sit up straight or you can lie down and just listen to the sound of my voice and the sound of this crystal bowl. Guys, there's a bunch of crazy stuff going on right now. I can't wait to um, get some more information and share some more short videos with you guys on this. But um, it's absolutely crazy. <laughs> like, this is the year right here. We're moving mountains right now. Even if you can't see it. So much is happening. I'm not sure I would like to do a, a reading on Canada. Tamla says she's been laying down since March. She gets visions easier that way. You can also put something over your eyes, like a little blindfold or something to help you see visions better. I find that helpful. Thank you. Clearing negative energies. From James Gill and an East Eddy Ranch, I have that too. Okay, guys. Charging foods with crystals. Of course, that's fantastic too. Blessing your food. All right. 
So we'll go ahead and get started. Take a sip. And I'm wondering, let me know in the chat and in the comments for those watching the replay, how many of you guys, just curious, want to eventually work for yourself and start your own business? Have ultimate freedom. Because we, we need that. And as humanity is waking up, we're, we're the leaders. We are the way showers. We are the first ones. A lot of people are going to need help. Fantastic. So if you guys have some goals in mind, like if you want to start your own business or, you know, whatever, it can also, it doesn't have to be money related. You can just open up to receive miracles, to receive healing, to receive blessings and allow it to come however way it comes. The universe will surprise you. You may get like a, win a bunch of money and a scratch off ticket or some sort of big check might randomly be mailed to you that you didn't know that you had. Your medical bills might be erased, just like with Leah. Yeah, fantastic. Also, thank you. We've got, uh, I've partnered with Hopewell Farm CBD and we've got 10% off right now with code Lily10. I almost forgot to mention that. High quality. CBD oil. I take it every single day. So their website is at the bottom of this video description. 10% off with code Lily10. How do we work on generational curses or black magic for lack of? The cord cutting will help clearing. We'll do a little bit of that today. Just meditate on it. Call in Archangel Michael. Okay. Okay, everybody. So we'll go ahead and get started. If you want to go ahead and get in a comfortable position and start taking a few deep breaths in. And as you breathe in, breathe light into your body. Breathing in light, exhaling any tension. All you have to do is listen to the sound of my voice and the sound of this bowl. See this light traveling in through your throat, into your heart. Feel your heart beginning to open and expand. Light traveling down your arms, your forearms, to the tips of your fingers. Light continuing down your torso, your thighs. Light down your calves and then to the tips of your toes. So we're setting the intention for this activation to assist us in eliminating any old programming, any lack, scarcity, programming. Allow us to shift our consciousness and be open to receive abundance and blessings from the universe, anchoring in abundance. Anchoring in a new abundant reality. Also, could it, cutting any old cords, generational curses, or scarcity mindset, traumas. Healing and releasing. Stepping into our power. So we will go ahead and create sacred space around each and every one of us, calling in Archangel Michael, the warrior, protector angel, 
Calling in Archangel Raphael, the healer magician, Archangel Gabriel and Uriel. These are the archangels of the four directions, north, east, south, and west. See them coming into the room, bringing in light, clearing any old energies from the room, clearing your energetic field, bringing in light down the walls, creating sacred space around you, holding each side of your energetic field, Calling in Archangel Metatron of the above space. Who brings down the golden Christ consciousness grid from the grand central sun straight from source. Visualize, feel, or know Metatron bringing down this golden light down through the sky. Entering into the top of your crown, your crown chakra begins filling with light, focusing on top of your head for a moment. See or feel your crown chakra opening, filling with light, connecting you to the divine, opening you up to receive divine downloads, upgrades, healing, abundance. Metatron continues down into your third eye. Your third eye chakra begins to fill with light and opens down to your throat. Your throat chakra fills with light and opens. And then anchoring within your heart, your heart fills with light and opens. Calling upon Archangel Sandalphon of the Below Space. Who brings up the 5D crystalline grid of the earth. This platinum light. See Sandalphon coming up to the earth's surface. Bringing this light into your earth star chakra. The chakras within your feet. Up to your root. Your root chakra begins to fill with light and opens into your sacral, your sacral chakra fills with light and opens into your solar plexus, filling with light, opens, and then anchoring within your heart. You are now held in every direction by light, these angelic beings, divinely held, protected, declaring this space sacred. We now call in our star families of the highest love and light to assist us in this clearing and activation. Our guides of the highest love and light, our ancestors of the highest love and light, come be here with us now. And feel the energy shift as you are surrounded. Guides of abundance, of blessings. Come be here with us now. And now we call in Archangel Ariel. The Archangel of Abundance. See Ariel entering into the room or wherever you are as a bright soft light, beautiful angelic being, powerful. Feel her energy surround you. feeling lighter. Now, we ask our star family and the guides to assist us in clearing out the root 
chakra. For any scarcity, lack, or fear programming, we know we now go down and focus on the root at the base of your spine. Focus on your root chakra. See it. Visualize it. It may be murky, dull, closed, blocked. Archangel Ariel, Star Family, the guides begin sending healing light and frequencies straight into your root. See the murky colors, the density blockages beginning to disintegrate and transmute. At the same time, this process is also happening to your ancestral lineage. You may see lines of ancestors standing behind you also receiving this clearing and healing in the root. If there are any negative energetic cords attached to your root that block your abundance, that anchor in a fear, lack, scarcity, programming from other lifetimes or from this lifetime, that fuel a toxic mindset on money or abundance or your worth, your self-worth. Archangel Michael steps forward and with his sword begins cutting all of these energetic cords that do not serve you as well as for the ancestral line. See these cords being cut, pulled out, transmuted by light, thrown into fire. Freeing you, releasing you. If there are any chains or curses or magic, dark magic, keeping you stuck or anchored into a fear, lack, scarcity program. We ask for source light, the archangels, the guides, to break through these chains, throwing them into the fire, releasing you. See these chains coming off of your body, your wrists, your legs, your ankles, your chakras. disintegrating them, freeing you. As this happens, you feel a surge of energy within you, in your solar plexus, in your root, a surge of light, your own true light, source light growing within you as your power returns to you, your confidence returns to you, while frequencies 
and light are still being sent to your root chakra and now your other chakras. Feel your solar plexus beginning to grow, your confidence growing, your worth, your self-worth. your light being returned to you, any dark magic, we ask that is now cleared, transmuted, affecting any of your other chakras, affecting you in general, physically, mentally, spiritually, transmuting it all to light. Also clearing any negative entities. We call in the Ascended Masters and Archangel Michael, Raphael. Clearing, transmuting any attachments. Escorting any dark entities back to their perfect place or transmuting them or sending them back to the light, clearing them as your energetic field becomes clear, your chakras become clear. We also send light to your heart. See Archangel Ariel sending her soft, compassionate, gentle, yet powerful light and energy straight into your heart chakra, helping to clear and open your heart, open you to receive abundance, blessings, miracles within your life, health, wealth, your heart expanding, opening, allowing more of your own true light and divine essence to pour through you, to embody you. The Arcturians also assist with pre reprogramming of your mind and our other star family working on your mind, your brain, eliminating any dark programming, any lack programming, any fear programming within your consciousness. Feeling things being rearranged, tweaked, new neural pathways being created to welcome in abundance, blessings, miracles to help you co-create a beautiful reality, helping you transcend, melting away any programming that does not serve you. You see a brighter future beyond you, before you, 
in a divine path leading you to your highest timeline, your highest purpose. The path before you becomes more and more clear. And also Archangel Michael cutting cords going back through your ancestral lineage. Also healing and clearing programming trauma in your ancestral lineage. Breaking any chains, curses from your ancestral lineage, from your family line. Just breathing in, allowing the work to be done. See your ancestors standing up straighter, happier, healthier, free. And now visualize yourself living an abundant, healthy life. Manifesting your desires, your highest potential, helping others, stepping into your power, confident, Visualize your highest potential. Successful. Healthy, happy. If there are any specific goals that you have, Visualize yourself manifesting them now so you can anchor this into this timeline, into your being in the here and now. Also making sure that any unworthiness are being cleared and transmuted at this time, shifted. Clearing any beliefs that do not support your highest timeline the expression of your true and highest form. See yourself happy, healthy, powerful. Dancing with the universe, enjoying yourself with absolute freedom. <laughs> and now Archangel Ariel reigns 
money and blessings down on you. She rains miracles and gifts down on you. If there are any last adjustments that your star family, the archangels, source would like to do on you, your energetic field, your chakras, your mind, we ask that they do so now, make any, any last adjustments for an abundance mindset to be open to receive blessings miracles love light healing they now put a bubble of light around you that will continue working on you throughout your day, throughout your night, if it is for your highest good, for your highest path. We ask that these beings continue to assist you if it is your desire. We send so much love and light to Archangel Ariel, to the other Archangels, Archangel Michael, Raphael, Gabriel, Uriel, Metatron, Sandalphon to the Ascended Masters, to our star families, to our ancestors. To Mother Gaia. Now anchoring this deep within our being, grounding this energy in the here and now, in this timeline. And whenever you are ready, you may begin coming back to your body, coming back to the here and now, feeling much lighter, brighter, with the path before you, divinely illuminated, things being woven for you in the background, having perfect trust and faith in who you are and your future and your higher path, Taking a few deep breaths in, and as you return, you may want to wiggle your fingers and toes. And then let me know how your experience was. Thanking all of the lovely beings again who assist in this clearing, this activation. And let me know what, if you are here now or the replay, let me know what are you manifesting? Goodness gracious. So I saw so much during that. Goodness. They were busy. I actually have a little bit of a headache. <laughs> <laughs> so you may want to drink a ton of water after this. Lots of tears. I feel young again. I love it, Scarlet. I started hearing a uh, ringing in my right ear that's a uh, higher frequencies fantastic me too headache yeah <laughs> yeah drink lots of water you guys ah. felt so much love and happiness katie one of the most visual meditations i've had yeah 
I saw there were tons of beings here, man. I'm like looking at a light, so it's kind of hard for me to like see visions with my third eye, but man, they were there. Spiritual millionaire business. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. You know, and affirmations are really great. Um, I don't know if you guys know, what's his name? Aaron Dowdy. He's a spiritual YouTuber. He has tons of uh, followers, subscribers, and he does a lot about the law of attraction. And he has a video called I Am a Spiritual Millionaire. And it is just, it's amazing. It's amazing. So affirmations to continue this energy. You know, I am a spiritual millionaire or whatever you want to do. I was shaking. That's new. <laughs> yeah. Ground. You may want to ground. Use some grounding stones after this. It's pretty cold outside. But if you live somewhere that's nice, you know, go outside. And we're also... We are this light and these light codes. We're anchoring this down into the earth and spreading it to the rest of the collective, which is fantastic. Yeah, I have a headache right now from the beginning. <laughs> yeah, drink tons of water, spiritual and financial abundance. How did you know I needed this today? That was beautiful. I was using different madras during the activation. That's amazing, Julia. Um, I just listen to what they tell me. So these activations are all divinely guided and, uh, yeah, this is needed to help usher. We're literally manifesting this in real time. We're helping to usher in uh, the collapse of the old systems in the creation of an abundance system. It's fantastic. So thank all of you who are here right now assisting in this process of creating the new earth. Um, and don't forget to like this video, leave a comment, share it if you would like. That really helps the channel. Ariel's frequencies felt... Felt uh, like the equivalent of a soft blanket. I felt that too. I agree. Ganesh. Ganesh. I don't know if I know Lashmi, but Ganesh, I absolutely love Ganesh. Ganesh is the remover of obstacles. So he is actually a fantastic being to work with as well. I absolutely love Ganesh. Manifesting a cottage where I live alone and the ability to do and sell my herb crafts. I love that. In my right ear. It's okay if you have the urge to cry. Let it all out. I feel better, more deserving. I have like zero self-confidence, anything. And I feel alive. Yeah, clearing that. And again, affirmations. I am becoming more and more confident each and every day. I am worthy of a successful business. I am worthy of my dream job. I am worthy of, you know, a beautiful, abundant life. Laura said, when you said shackles break off, I saw wings pop out and start flying. Yeah, whenever I mentioned, as soon as I said the shackles, I saw uh, Archangel Raphael specifically. Uh, I saw a bunch going on too. That really triggered something. Thank you, Deborah. Feeling cranial pressure but no pain. Yeah, I feel that too. Lyran presence. Beautiful. Peace. Awesome. I feel that the revolution, revaluation of foreign currencies is near. You know, I've heard a little bit about that too. It hasn't come up recently, but uh, I had somebody send me some foreign currency um, in the last year because they are under the impression that it's going to be changing a lot of value too. So that's another thing. If you feel called, you can invest in foreign currency because that might be going way up. Hi, Colleen. Okay. Amazing, guys. And I saw good, beautiful grays. Love it. If um, if you feel called, of course, you can do this activation again. There are other, you know, tons of meditations, too, that you can go or you can do affirmations. This is a really good question, so I'm going to answer it real quick. Guys, how do you know that people who talk about channeling, etc., are reliable? So the star beings actually showed me this in the last five months that some of the channelers on um, on YouTube or just some of the channels that are out there, they uh, are not channeling who they think they are. So it's really, really important for you to, whenever you're watching something, see how it feels in your body. And if something doesn't sit right with you, if it doesn't make you like kind of like feel good, if it doesn't feel like truth, just don't listen to it. Don't feed it. Humanity is learning a really big lesson in discernment right now. So you can meditate on it too. You can even ask, like you can sit in meditation and you could say, 
okay, spirit, my guides of the highest love and light, if you're wondering about a specific person, say, please show me their true form and then meditate on it and see what happens. Wow. Bulls made my crystals vibrate. That's beautiful. Awesome. Thank you, Zach. I appreciate that. That was super intense. I could literally feel unworthiness leaving my body. I love that. Oh. I would love my own business. Tired of working a nine to five. All right, let's manifest it, guys. We're going to need a lot of spiritual business owners. Beautiful. Okay, guys. So like I said, after this, I'm taking uh, two weeks off from the lives. I don't know how I'm going to do it. <laughs> uh, so I challenge you to go through some of my other activations. If you want to still keep the Sunday, you know, the routine, uh, and also turn on the notification bell because I may be posting other shorter videos, updates over the next couple weeks. And yeah, I guess that's about it. Wow. Thank you, Lily. Lily is the only channeler I trust. I also trust Dolores Cannon's material. Yeah, but she wasn't a channeler. Hi, Craig. Yeah, come back. Come back and do this. I also have a short violet flame meditation. That's really fantastic for transmuting and transformation. So doing the violet flame, you can do like a five minute violet flame each day. Fantastic. Uh, I do have a connect with your higher self activation. You could probably type in Lily Nova higher self or look through my live tab, the live tab. So I have a bunch of different playlists or you can just, you know, sit and meditate, set that intention, ask. Open your heart. Awesome. Okay, guys, I will see you, I guess, after two weeks, hopefully beforehand. I might do a pop-up thing if some news or updates come in. And just thank you guys for being here. Please like this video, drop a comment. It really helps the channel. And, of course, I do have my workshop, Psychic Development, DNA Activation, uh, the DNA Activation Kits, Ancestral Healing Workshops, if you feel called to doing those. And those are in the video description. I will see you later, Star Brothers and Sisters. Bye.